I had to spin sinks a lot around to uh, be able to get my pickup to back up to it, to hook onto it. And tires are junk on it, so pretty flat. It was nosed into that out of the truck, which is broke down now. This whole flatbed truck is what I'm talking about. Apparently a blue head gasket. So I'm going to hook up the sink slot and go park it in a new place that I made so it'll be out of the way. My son's thinking about taking the engine out of this and putting it in another little boat that he got. It's got uh, the 454. So the thing would probably run down the lake. If you didn't have it loaded down too much, just a couple people, it'd run down the lake about 53 miles an hour according to the speedometer on the on the boat. It was a good old boat. We just sank too much. On this side of the boat you can kind of see the hull damage that it had. Uh, unbeknownst to me when I bought it, it had been left nose down in the winter time and water accumulated in the front of the bow here and literally broke the bow out and uh, so probably the first two years that I ran this boat it tried to sink on us. Uh, we figured right around ten times. But I fixed this this hole and the last time I had it out it did a really good job. So my namesake here is probably going to end up going to the boneyard but at least the, the engine and the outdrive will get used again.